thought uh, Violin played really well. Um, yeah, I mean... Feed my ego. I think uh, I think you did the right thing, and I think after you guys were up one zero, I think you did well not taking any risks. With, uh, sorry, risks with base, and um, yeah, I probably would have done it the same way. So um, good job. Thanks. I think that MM made a, a crucial mistake in trying to outside flag, maybe a little bit too late. I think Scarface went for that outside flag attempt, and when Scarface did that action, action he um, he d he didn't kill somebody when he had the opportunity to because he thought, strange. yeah, no, because yeah, because he thought that Scarface had a good attempt. But I think it was a little bit too late for Scarface yeah, to go for it. Go. Uh, I, thought I thought it was it was too late. Yeah. Okay, we've got this uh, this recording going right now. So let's let's talk first of all to uh, to Meek, um, your team won. Uh, give me a recap on how you think that uh, that game went, and uh, was it what you expected? Um, I expected us to win. I feel like uh, most of Spark right now is kind of bad. I don't see anyone in good shape, including Sebek. So <laughs> I don't know. Our teamwork is fine. We have been working a bit as of late, and uh, it went our way because we raped better than them, had better communication. All right, well, that's an interesting challenge to Sebek. No, it's I not a challenge. challenge him. It's just a fact. He, he's not playing that well either right now. Get off my dick, bitches. <laughs> <laughs> how, about, uh, how about the guys from MM? How did you feel the game went? Do you think it could have gone better? They're tough, uh, especially Ella. With he kind of like mini spikes around and stuff. Yeah, that annoyed me. Yeah. Do we have anyone from MM in here right now? No. I just tried not to get frustrated, and I uh, kept doing what I do when I was versus him. Well, Amon and I were talking uh, while that game was going on that, uh, you know, LA is definitely one of the uh, the top players out there. Um, what is your strategy? Um, Ella, Ella was pushing a lot, uh, especially after your first cap, to go and, and really push for a flag run. Um, why do you think he was doing that, and, and what was your strategy for taking care of it? He knows that he's hard to hit, and that he can take two on ones and dish out a lot of damage. So even if the flag attempt goes poorly, he he could leave like two players really hurt, and their team would have the momentum. Yeah. Uh, we just raped him, and we weren't too passive versus him. You you can't just you know sit back. You, you just play the game the right way and rape him. And when you have an opportunity to do a lot of damage, you take it and you don't miss. I think that was the key. Our raping is uh, much superior. Uh, once we start the rape, we finish it, and I think uh, MM might have lost because they didn't finish the rapes. The only time a rape uh, failed, it was my fault. I left Meek uh, versus Ella, who was one hit, and Ella ended up killing him. I, I was just sitting there not doing shit, so it was my fault. <laughs> that was definitely one of the comments that uh, that Amon was making, as Ella was trying to, uh, first of all, put a lot of pressure on you guys to take away some of your uh, players from going on another flag run. Um, as well, hopefully take the opportunity. But you guys, yeah, it, it looked like you definitely did the right thing from his perspective in that you uh, you just, instead of, you know, playing aggressively to go for the flag, you did the smart thing and brought a player back to rape Ella. Uh, any other thoughts on how you feel that game went? Well, I knew they were going to try for outside flags, especially because that's a, a strong tactic on red. So our flag, uh, the one that we did get, I never even got into their base. I was just outside camping uh, the spawners, and it, and it worked out. Well, let's um, let's give the community an opportunity to, to speak here. Guys, uh, if you're on Spark right now, uh, do me a favor and PM me if you'd like to ask a question. We'll do it in order of people who PM me. Um, just let me know in the PM who you're going to ask the question to, and then I'll give you the floor. Let's see if we can get some questions from the community. <laughs> All right, so Wispiel uh, has a question for Meek, so go ahead, Wispiel. I'm curious uh, to know 
uh, how you felt about uh, Axon's performance uh, this match. He appeared to play uh, quite sloppy and make some critical mistakes. Uh, what's your input on that? Um, that action, <laughs> in a nutshell, he, uh, he tends to choke a lot. I disagree with that. I mean, his overall game is, uh, is quite good, but when he gets over-anxious, he chokes a lot. I just don't think he was uh, individually up to the task of facing V, who we can all maybe take him one-on-one, -on -one, and with our rape and our, yeah. our ability to stay alive, he uh, made too many errors. He's, like, uh, he's much like Puffball. He relies a lot on his explosions to make a big burst of damage. But we managed to pick him apart a lot of the times from distance. Do you think his uh, mentality towards the game has anything to do with his performance? Yes, of course. Now, can you explain for everybody else, first of all, uh, what you mean by that? Um, because not everybody, I, it sounds to me like that's a bit of an inside comment. Um, so what do you mean his mentality towards the game? His light-hearted um, point of view towards the game. Uh, he, he doesn't ever tend to take things in a serious manner when those particular scenarios will require a serious attitude. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, uh, next, Turbo has a question for Meek. Hi Meek, this is Turbo from CADF Times. Um, I would have a question. <laughs> How do you compare your clan's current skill level to last year in SPL? And also, can you fill in, um, will NBMA be playing a lot of games this season? All right, well, first off, I think um, our overall team play is much better. We have much more awareness. And, um, but, I said, but as I said before, uh, I think everyone on Spark is kind of bad right now. I don't see anyone standing out. So on any given day, we can beat anyone. And what was the other question? Um, it was just regarding um, MBMA, how active is he? Oh, right. Be? He will only play if he has to. He doesn't want to play Spark, only League of Legends. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, we have a question. Uh, Basic or Dip would like me to ask a question by proxy while he goes for a smoke. Um, so he's curious, have you learned anything new? Uh, this is for you again, Meek. Have you learned anything new to keep an eye on or how to strategize against the future games against MM? Well, um, it depends on their lineup, to be honest. I think uh, I can abuse certain people certain ways. If they put Crow in, he's relying a lot on his lag. So uh, on a distance, I can always own him. So it depends. If they put Perspolis on there from the beginning, we just put a heavy rape on him because he's very fragile in rapes. Now that is, uh, that is also a, a very interesting question. Um, you know, they did switch Crow for Perspolis after you guys capped the first flag run. Um, what did you think of that? It, did you, you know, in, in your opinion as a, a team leader, so to speak, are you going to immediately get on the horn to your, your folks and say, okay, look, you know, they switched this person. How did you change your strategy for your team at that point? Or did you feel you even had to? No, we, don't, we didn't need to change anything. So you guys just know it instinctively? Yeah. Okay. All right, so there's a, there's a question for Turbo, uh, for Veritas, another question. Um, Justin, how would you compare your clan's um, current teamwork to that of um, UAC? I mean, obviously, Violent doesn't have a king killer, so how, how did you adjust? Um, that's actually a really good question. Overall... Uh, USC always had a weak fourth. I don't know if you remember that, but we had like Bigfoot as our fourth. So V's overall like teamwork and raping is superior. But if I were to play with like Shrink to this day or KK to this day, we know exactly what we're gonna do. We're aggressive and like individually with those players, our, our UAC's raping was better. As far as adjusting, uh, without somebody that's going always to get the flag by KK. He was our offensive threat. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't really have a set role in V. I think Meek and the other guys are better at flagging. Flagging's probably the worst thing I'm at. So 
uh, I'll still leave the flag into other people. All right. Uh, Seven, you have a question. Uh, oh, actually, Seven uh, doesn't have his mic, so I'm going to have to ask this one. Um, this is for both Meek and Veritas. Are you guys afraid for next week's game versus AOA? <laughs> no. He stole Photon, so... Well, what do you think, Veritas? Are you afraid? Actually, a clan like AOA is who I perform the best against. They're not bad enough that I get bored, but they're not good enough to really pose a threat. <laughs> <laughs> you like, you like that just, answer, Seven? Seven just gave a, a response to Meek's stealing, <laughs> stealing Photon from them. Uh, Photon isn't a good player at the moment. Dark Evil says we'll see you next week. So it looks like uh, next week's challenge of V versus AOA is going to be one that we'll all be looking forward to. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> Meek's just I'm like, gonna let's have see my how way quick with them. Ooh, how quickly are you going to be able to take them down? Uh, well, let's take let's take a look at that. What do you think? Um, the question was asked, so let's let's get an idea of what the audience has to say. Um, do we think it's going to be a three nothing for V? Yes. No, wait, wait, wait. Take that back. Um, I'd say depending on who violence shows. Um, granted, they do have a pretty uh, deep clan as far as. Um, good pilots, uh, a lot of depth. Um, I would say my prediction for that game is that um, AOA is going to try to come out strong, uh, but in the end, they are going oh, to yeah. get pummeled, and I predict the 2-0 for Violent. Well, what do you guys think, uh, V? Depends on who plays. We, we could even lose, you know. They can beat us. Go ahead, Mink. He's a bit too humble. And how about next your uh, your game with CADF? That's a game I look forward to. I always uh, like to play those guys, even though they want Clan War S. But I'm looking forward to that one. I think we are going to tie them. 1-1. One, one. Uh, I'm not sure how that game's going to go down. Turbo, what do you say? Um, I don't know. There could be some bias with with what I'm about to say, but I think if both of our top lines show, I think CADF should be able to win. Um, I know Veritas is a new addition, and he kind of changes the front lineup for Violent, but I still think CADF should have the upper hand. Um, I think we... Well, I don't know. I don't want to say for sure because I, I, I'm not sure. But I think we beat <laughs> Violent last season. I'm not sure what the score was though. Turbo, how do you feel about your tie game with iLogic today? <laughs> um, you're, I think you're in the wrong game. It was garbage. Let's move on. <laughs> Nobody asked Turbo how he felt about it though. I don't expect uh, CADF to play like they did today versus us, but if they do, we will win. Easily. All right. Well, we're all looking forward to those games. Uh, guys, thanks again for coming out to, uh, to the live broadcast after the game. Uh, if there's nothing further from anyone on Meek or on, uh, on V or, uh, or M, MM, uh, if there's no, nothing else from either of those teams, then we'll close this off, and uh, we'll see you at the next game. I just want to add that uh, I was impressed by Perspolis dodging. Yeah. There's actually a key sequence uh, in our base where I couldn't finish off uh, Perspolis until I got a nade. To my credit, he didn't kill me, even though uh, I was nervous as hell. Well, that's it for this uh, this broadcast. Again, um, I'm going to post this up uh, on a site, and you get, it'll be available for download.